back to the Sims 3 into the future. So I just had to reset the town because my game was running really, really weird. Uh, that is why this looks like this for some reason. I don't know when I reset it that popped up. I don't, I don't get it, but it's there. It's fine. Um, but I went ahead and had her improve the meal quality of this to level two. And now we have to reach level seven of advanced technology to improve it even further, which she had some food that she ordered from there and it was bad quality. So I really hope that when we get it to level three, the quality of the food will not be horrible because that would kind of suck. Uh, what do you want to do? Scan Mercedes hail. Let's do it. Cause I'm curious what that does. Um, let's see. Holodis, Plumbot, Scan Target. Let's see what this does. I'm just a little curious, but I do want her to kind of maybe go create another Plumbot to sell and see, see what's going on with that. See if we can create one to be a little bit better. And then we're going to see if we can also tune her up. Uh, go ahead and answer your phone we're gonna see who that was um so did that not do anything i guess it didn't do anything i don't know that was weird uh ewen larson wants to know if i don't know who that is who is that uh let's just go ahead and say yes because i'm kind of curious to see who it is and her maintenance and um battery power is fantastic so we will see if we can maybe tune up zeta when we come home, I'm curious to... Oh, he's taking us to the graveyard. So that's kind of scary. Are you going to kill us? Because I really hope that that's not what's going to happen. <laughs> Please don't murder us. I am not... I'm not about that, okay? That is so interesting. Do we know this person? I'm really confused. Oh, I was like, is that him? No, that's Edwin. Oh, it's this guy right here. Um... Wow, those birds are chirping very loudly. Okay, I mean, whatever, whatever. We're not we're not with Harkin yet, and I know you guys like him a lot, so we probably will be, but uh, you know, whatever. We're going to go ahead and see what this guy is all about, what he wants, and all of that jazz. I actually love the little gravestones in the future. I think they're so cool looking. I don't know why. I just think they're really neat. Oh, we could we could get some tomatoes, you guys. I think it's so random that there's just tomatoes in the graveyard. And ooh, a oh, hole, a death flower, and more tomatoes. Okay, that's interesting. Let's see, what does this guy look like? I don't really remember. He's actually not bad if we just fixed his hair a little bit and everything else about him. <laughs> I'm terrible. Let's ask him about his career. We'll kind of get to know him. We'll see if they're attracted to each other at all. I mean, I don't know. Maybe they are. We'll take a look and see. Uh, let's go ahead and consider attractiveness. We'll see what's going on. I'm interested to see what he does for work. Uh, oh, oh, he's unemployed. Okay. Is Harkin unemployed too? I feel like he is as well. He is. I need to turn on story progression for the future to get everybody a job and like doing things, you know, and maybe getting a family going for some of these people. Um, so he's a Capricorn. Let's see, what else do we got going? All right. So we're going to see if he's single. And we're going to see if they're even attracted to each other, which I guess they are since it says attractive company. So they must be attracted to each other a little bit. Uh, we'll go ahead and flatter him. And maybe should we start a do fight? Oh, my God. That would be so cool. Oh, he is in a relationship. Boy, get out of here. Who is this person? Oh, he's he's freaking married, boy. No. Um, and they're only seven out of ten. Okay, we're we're gonna say goodbye because you're married and that is just not right. So goodbye. <laughs> yeah, this that this time I'm like, this is not right, but in my like current households I'm all about like destroying relationships. What are you doing? No, we're not gonna chat with him. We're gonna do what we originally were gonna do, which is go straight over here to nuts and bolts emporium or whatever the hell it's called yes whatever and we're gonna start uh, i'm thinking of leaving soon well i'm leaving so <laughs> goodbye okay okay we're gonna see if we can create another plum bot because i want to and i want to see if we can get some monies and we need 895 simoleons until our next promotion. So maybe we can create a little bit better of a plum bot this time around. Let's take a look and see. Oh, these two are getting really romantic. 
Can you hear that? Okay. Excuse me? Okay, that is so loud. Let's go ahead and create a plum bot and see how much we can sell it for because she does want to sell one. So we'll give it we'll give it a go and we're gonna see if we can hang out with Harkin as well because last time I totally failed. Apparently I didn't hit jetpack risky woohoo. I just hit regular risky woohoo. So maybe we'll try that again in this part and maybe I'll pay attention a little bit better, but who knows? It's me. I don't pay attention to a lot of things. I try, but, you know, can't help it. I'm a dummy sometimes. Oh, my God. My cat is snoring again. Okay, this needs to hurry up. I don't have time for these loading screens. Ah, I had to get some waters. Sippy, sippy. Okay, there we go. Why are they always so cool when they load up? Like, I don't even want to do anything with this one. I just like the way they look. We just have to give them a name. Okay, let's just give them... P505. Okay. Yeah, we're just going to go with that. We're going to just keep you like that because that was easy enough. I like that they match the colors. Usually it's like a total fail when it's Sims and stuff. So let's see what kind of quality Plumbot we get out of this. And we're going we're gonna to sell them and check in on our... Uh oh, our little consignment stuff. So we'll see if we can purchase anything. Um, ooh, yay! We just got to bot building skill level five. Mercedes is becoming an experienced bot builder and can now upgrade trait chip slots, which is perfect on Plumbots to allow more trait chips to be installed. Whenever Mercedes creates a new Plumbot, it will start with four trait chip slots. Awesome! Okay, let's see here. Uh, let's go over here and tune you up. Let's see what you are like. <gasps> you are an average. That is awesome. You're level four, or you're, I guess, not really level, but. Okay, let's see what we can do. Do we have any trait chips that we can put in him? What is this? Why do you have your food here? Why did you put your food in your inventory? Let's see if there's anything we can purchase here to install, because they will be... He'll be worth a little bit more, you know, with trait chips and stuff like that. So let's see if there's anything cheap we can buy. If not, maybe we can purchase a couple. I just don't really want to, if it's if we're just getting, you know, selling it, I don't really want to waste our nanites and stuff. And I definitely don't want to use these guys. So, yeah. Alrighty. We still need quite a lot of points to get our lifetime reward for that, uh, the, the searching for the objects, the little butterfly thingamajigger. Okay, let's see. Let's go ahead and purchase competent cleaner. Ooh, a robo nanny, robotany gardener, and then a large blank processor, a medium blank processor. We're gonna spend all kinds of money because we have the money, so we might as well do it. Um, and I guess we'll go ahead and get these as well. We'll just purchase all of that. Okay, good. It doesn't say we got ripped off, so that is always really good. Okay, come over here and we're going to ooh, upgrade trait chip slots. Look at him over here. Okay, we're going to make you stop because everybody's going to go over there and I don't feel like dealing with it. Okay, and then we're going to adjust trait chips. Oh, oh, it looked like that she just hit him in the head. Okay, so we now have four trait chip slots. Awesome. Okay, let's go ahead and upgrade and, or not upgrade, but install some of these and then we're going to sell them and see what kind of money. Ooh, we got a good deal. That's awesome. Okay, so we're going to do Competent Cleaner, uh, Robo Nanny, and Robotany Gardener because those are all really good things. I don't want to do Fear of Humans, although I guess it really doesn't matter, but those are pretty good. So we're going to go ahead and sell T505. I hope we get some good money for him because he's a pretty decent quality plum bot. So, yeah, we've got average he's average okay Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. heck yes we're gonna get a promotion you guys so we're gonna sell him for 1729 simoleons i always hate doing this though because when they wave by i get so sad so this is just like really difficult for me but we're gonna get a promotion and i'm really excited like look at that that is that makes me really sad and i really kind of want to get a picture can we get a picture of this without it being like too weird Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna go like that. Good enough. Okay. 
Oh, well, hopefully somebody awesome purchases you and takes good care of you. So, congratulations, Mercedes has been conferred the new title of Circuit and Integrator by the Oasis Landing Town Council in recognition of her valuable contributions to the workforce. Having mastered mechanical components, Mercedes Hale is ready to manipulate artificial intelligence. It's another step in her bot building career. Mercedes now makes 60 simoleons per week. Awesome. So... What is this? Create a bot. We will probably do that again, but I'm not going to make another one right now. Uh, I do want her to kind of work on, so we need 1,666 simoleons for our next um, promotion. So let's see if we can design a couple of trait chips and nanites just to see if we can discover anything new. And then I think we're going to see where we can maybe, maybe we can ask him out on a date somewhere. Okay, can you stop, like, really stop? Okay, thank you. So let's see if we can discover anything new. I'm going to check up on Zeta. Zeta wants to equip a capacity to love? Oh my gosh, wait. You want to do it or you want the capacity to love? I'm not quite sure. But we're going to go ahead and see what that's all about. She wants to improve her bot building skill, which she just did. So I don't think she will be that quickly. Let's see. What else could we do? Ooh, I really want to find another one of those. I love these things. There was one, like, right back here. I don't know where they're, like, normally at, but I really want to find another one. Those things are so cool. I think we only found, like, a rainbow trout or something, but I think you can find money in them, if I'm not mistaken. Like, money bags or something. But I don't really see any around here. But she does want to find one. So maybe, you know, maybe we'll run into one. I'm trying to figure out what we could do for a date. So we discovered how to build the Sinister Circuits trait chips. That sounds intense. Okay, so... Oh, never mind. Okay, so we're going to go. Where should we go? We can go to the theater. Um, I really don't know where we could go. I want to be able to try that woohoo. So maybe we should just go to the park again and try, try again to get that situation. But what do we need for social? We need, oh, we could get sinister circuits, capacity love, but we really want the sentience trait. So that we'll have to figure out how to make. Hopefully we can figure out how to build that. All right. So it looks like he is going to meet us there, which is perfect and she wants to kiss him and then learn two more of his traits well actually one more because it looks like we have one out of two so i hope this disappears this is really annoying but it was like something from the dream i think she had like a oh, i hate that little bald looking spot that looks so stupid uh but she had a decent dream she dreamed about generations or something like that i think okay so here we are and He's coming over to chat with us, and we're going to try this, um, oh god, he just fell on his butt, you silly dude. Okay, we're going to see if we can do this risky woohoo with him, because, like, why freaking not? And not in the bathroom, we're going to announce our promotion to him. Ooh, actually, he thinks we're being extremely irresistible already, so we're going to go ahead and give him a kiss, since he really wants to do that, or she wants to do that, I mean. And we're going to, where is your, we're going to start using our jetpack and we're going to try and see if this works out. Okay, that's not creepy. Like, yeah, now that I noticed you, you're, you're driving away. Yeah, okay. That was just really, really weird. I did not like it. Oh, girl. Okay, so I'm going to see if there's anything else she wants to do. She wants to build the sinister circuits, which we can do that. And what are you going to do? Oh, he's going to give us flowers? Oh, how cute. Okay, let's try a jetpack kiss. Oh my god, she actually wants to do that. So I'm going to actually put that in there instead. Let's see. Let's see if it works. Oh my gosh. Is it going to work? Is it going to work? Oh my gosh. Oh it's gonna work and i can't i can't <gasps> this is too much how am i gonna get a picture of this like how is this even gonna work okay okay i'm sorry guys but you know that i have to take pictures that's just how i am that's just how i am okay this is like a little awkward looking but we're gonna go with it 
Oh my gosh. They are so cute. Oh my gosh. <gasps> How cute are they? Okay, we're gonna do we're gonna do a jetpack risky woohoo as well because why the heck not? My foot is asleep because I've been sitting on it and it's like oh my gosh, it feels like a million ants crawling on my feet. Okay, is this gonna work? So maybe he doesn't have to have a jetpack just as long as she does because she's carrying him. That, oh my god. Okay, hold on. That was quick. Where did they even go? Where did they go? Where did they go? Did they go into the ground? What in the world? I'm so confused, but they just risky woohooed, I guess. And there's still little petals falling. Okay, this is a little bit weird. Are they like stuck? I think they might be stuck, you guys. Oh, okay. There they go. There they go. Oh my goodness. Should we check and see if she's pregnant? Should we do it? I kind of want to know. Let's do it. We're going to check. Okay. We're going to go to Enroz, Master Controller. We're going to go to Status, Relationship. Okay. She's not pregnant. <gasps> Whew, I wasn't I wasn't quite ready for that, but that's okay. I think we should maybe just go ahead and make it official with him though, because you guys like him and I think they are so cute together. So let's go ahead and compliment his appearance and then... Let's flirt a little bit and then we'll go. She does want to go get food. So maybe we'll go out and get some dinner. We'll hold hands. I just want to make it official with him. I think they're adorable. I'm just going to X out of that. Oh my gosh. She wants to do another jetpack kiss. Where was that? Eat at restaurant. That stuff's going to lock in. Okay. So he thinks we're being alluring. Um, Can we do it yet? Can we do it? Can we do it? Uh, Let's do a little shy kiss. Oh my goodness, so cute. Why can't we? Okay, he still thinks we're just being alluring. Okay, really? Gaze into his eyes. Stare straight into his eyes and be like, we are so in love with you. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, let's go ahead and propose going steady. There we go. I'm like, really? <gasps> oh, you guys, Mercedes has a boyfriend now. <gasps> that is so cute. Okay, we're gonna go and we're gonna get some food since she is hungry. Okay, she wants to go to a restaurant, so I guess it really doesn't make a difference. Let's eat here with our date. Hopefully he's hungry because she is pretty hungry and she is pretty tired as well. But we're gonna oh Jetta or Jetta <laughs> Zetta is charging. So when we get home, we're gonna kind of have Zetta um tune her up a little bit. What are you doing? Why are you just standing there with like a freaking Chandler ass smile on your face? Like really? There we go. He changed. But it's probably going to take forever because they're both doing the stride of pride, which really, come on. Oh my god. Are you serious? Okay. Well, I guess it's just right across the street. But seriously, they have to do this the whole way there. Wee. You better get in there. It's pouring down rain and you guys want to be doing that. Seriously, get inside and get some food. Are you are you serious right now? Are you are you serious? Are you are you kidding me? <sighs> You've got my number right. I'll look forward to hearing from you. He just he left. The air smells fresher, the birds are twittering in delight, and you feel like you're walking on tiptoes as if you might suddenly burst into flight. That date was incredible. Oh. Oh, oh, okay. But it looks like he is actually going to go eat with us. So what I'm going to do is just have them eat, have her go home and go to sleep, and I'll cut back in the morning, and we're going to see if we can go find some more of those nanites somewhere, you know, out in the in the little desert area. So I will be back right, in a little bit, so guys. we are back, and it is almost 9 in the morning, so we had her dream about family last night look at how cute she is and it says confusing dreams have been have made mercedes skeptical about family ties at the same time she's reminded friendliness is important so i think she has yeah she's got the friendly trait which it replaced and it will be there for about 11 hours uh we're gonna have her come over here and have some french toast how about that and hopefully it is not terrible quality because that would really suck but let's see what is it Awesome. It's great quality. Maybe we ate the food or we got the food before she... I don't know. I don't know. But the last food that she got out of there was bad quality and it was disgusting. So that sucks. 
All right, Zeta, what are you up to? Why don't you see how your little sprite is? Go ahead and clean. Oh, you changed it? Talk and clean. And I want to change you your sprite. It was a little rainbow guy. I don't know why it's like not a rainbow anymore. I didn't change it, but maybe she did. So who knows? Um, we're going to go ahead and put these flowers here that he gave us and we're going to get rid of this food that she's had in her inventory because we don't need that. All right. Are you going to clean this up, please? Oh, look at you're playing with your little guy too. Okay. We're going to clean Bronson and talk to and also feed. Oh, I forgot. We're not, uh, no, we're not going to feed one of those because I really don't want to lose any of those little nanites that we have. Okay, but I do want her to go to that little land that we have over, over yonder, which is pretty far away, over here. I think, let's see, what is this little area? The barren wasteland. Uh, we'll come over here. I'm going to see if we can actually look for anything. Ooh, there's like stuff we can excavate and there's crystal plants over here. I'm not seeing any nanites crawling around. I'm not quite sure. Ooh, what is this? Oh, that's just a bug, I think. Yeah, it's nothing important. These are just bugs crawling around. Dang, I can't wait until we have enough lifetime reward points to get the little collection helper because that will clearly help us a heck of a lot. I'm not seeing any at all crawling around here and that kind of sucks. I don't know if they're like out at, that sounds so stupid but out at certain times of the day this is like a little um a space rock there but i don't see anything what in the heck what in the heck i kind of want to, okay like i said i wasn't ready for a baby but i kind of want to do the little uh oh what is it hold on hold on i have to look what it's called Where's the, like, the hospital? Is it the hospital? Yes, obviously it's the hospital. Stupid. Okay, engineer a baby. I kind of want an engineer a baby. I think that that would be kind of fun. So let me know in the comments down below if we should engineer a baby with Harkin. And yeah, let me know. We'll, we'll see how that goes. If you guys say yes, I'll try to remember to put a little poll somewhere around here if I can remember for the life of me if you guys want me to engineer baby this early on. But, you know, it could be fun. It could be interesting. All right, well, since there's really no nanites out and about, I kind of want her to go... Ooh, take a space training class. Experiment with zero G. Zero gravity. Durr. Uh, You know what? I think we're just going to kind of let her maybe see if we can discover some nanites. Let's go ahead and come up here and design nanites. Design trait chips is what I really want to learn. And we'll try to build a trait chip if we have the, um, you know, the right items that we need. But I'm going to be ending this part very, very soon because my time is up for sure. I've been trying to make them a little bit shorter because that way whenever I'm rendering the video, it doesn't take like 5 million hours. I need to get a new program because Vegas Pro takes way too long and I would have so many things done much quicker if I could have something that was a little bit better, but we're stuck with that for now, and I know how to use it, so there's that. Oh my gosh, those birds are so loud. What do you need to do? Perform a self-tune-up. Actually, I want you to come here. Come up here. I want you to tune her up, because I want to see if we can get her a better quality. Okay, so we learned how to build the Tribble Nanite. So let's come over here and... um tune up and then we're gonna upgrade her trait chip slots as well because she does not have the amount that i want her to have hopefully we'll be able to open all of the trait chips and you know make her into basically a real person so that she can you know socialize and have fun and all of that stuff okay so what what quality is she she's one so that's not good not good at all <coughs> oh my goodness okay did that help her Come on. No? No? Doesn't look like it. Well, that sucks. Oh! Oh my god! You don't have to knock her in the head! Okay, so there we go. She upgraded her trait chip slot. So come over here and we're going to design trait chips and then we're going to see if we can create one and see if we have anything that we could possibly 
that we could possibly make. And if we can't, you know, find something that we can install in her, we can at least sell it for our job. So we'll give it a try. I just really wish he could learn how to make the sentience trait, or uh, yeah, the trait chip thingy. But I have a feeling that's going to be something that's going to take a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. But we're going to try. So, ooh, sense of humor trait chip for sure. Can Will that open her socialization? It will. Oh my goodness. Okay, hopefully we can do that. Let's see if we can try to build that. I bet you we're going to need, um, let's see. Oh my gosh, I thought my cat was like throwing up. <laughs> oh, we do. We need a crystal flower, but we have one and we need three small blank processors. So we're going to go ahead and create that and then install it into Zeta. And then I'm going to wrap this part up because it's been long enough and I still have a bunch more videos I need to be making. Okay, Zeta, where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Okay, I really want you to change this back. And I can't remember. I think it might have been this one. Let's see. That was the rainbow? No, it's not that one. Okay. Um, let's see. I really want, I want the rainbow one. Oh my gosh, that one's, a oh, that one is actually really cool. It's like a little devil. Okay, we're going to keep that. And you want to do a self tune up. So why don't you just go ahead and do that and come down here, honey bunny, so that we can install this trait chip into Miss Zeta. Kind of excited. I am kind of excited that we'll be able to socialize with her now. <gasps> okay. Are we ready? We are. We are. We are. She's like, can, can we do it? Can we do it? Zeta's like, okay, I guess I trust you. <laughs> okay. So we're going to go ahead and put this in there. It says activates the social meter, meter, enables a wide range of joking interactions, introduces Plumbot to the world of professional comedy shows. What? Hold on, like they can, wait a minute. What? Professional comedy shows. I am so interested in figuring out what that's all about. <laughs> okay, so now our socialization is there. So now we can be funny. Oh, okay. I was thinking it was like a job that, that she could have. That was like really weird to me. Okay, let's see what happens when she performs a comedy show. Cause I'm, I'm kind of curious, kind of, kind of curious. Look at her, she's so funny. What did you see on there, girl? Okay, like, what are you doing? It looks like you keep stabbing yourself in the butt. Okay, hurry up. I want to see your comedy show. Okay, are you doing it? Oh my god. This is so cute. Are you gonna watch? Come on, watch her comedy show. Can we tip her? Oh, why can't we give her a tip? <laughs> oh no she's being mean leave her alone she just got her trait chip so you know what maybe she's not that funny just yet but give her some time anyways i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this part right here i hope that you guys enjoyed it let me know what you guys think in the comments down below also take the poll that i had probably a little while back and let me know even in the comments if we should engineer a baby with um harkin Maybe we should move him in. I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. Leave a like on this video if you guys are enjoying it as it helps me out a lot. Subscribe before you go if you've not already. And as usual, I love you all so very much. And I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye, guys.